Hi, welcome to the fourth tutorial in getting started with Seb Blood. Today we're going to be creating um, relationships between content using modules. Um, yeah, so let's get started. Uh, the, the example today is going to be um, making our author pages have a list of the author's books on them. So first of all we need to create a, a new content type called books. So I'll just do that quickly. Alright, this is the important part. The field that you need to add here is um, a related article. This is a really neat field in Seblood. So this is going to pull all the, um, create a simple drop down list uh, from all the authors available in, in the, um, the system. Okay, that's going to do for now because I'm not going to have author content pages. So now we can see if we go into the article manager and we create a new book. Let's call this one the red book. And we'll upload a red book. And find the book author. Let's say I'm the author of the red book. And click save. Got our book title there. Okay. Now, we want to go back and create a list. Or we need to go back, sorry, to our author uh, content type and add a new field to it. And this is where we're going to load the um, module into. So we create a new field. So a module, and we're going to call it auth books. And the position, you can just make this up, but you got to remember what you set it to. Um, we'll make it XHTML is the Chrome style. Alright, that's all good. Save and close. Now we need to create a list type. And this is going to be based on the books content type. I'm going to call it author's books. Alright, now we need to add the book author, um, the related article fields that we made before. And in the live value, we're going to set it to var, well, var and then an int in brackets, and we're going to set this to id. What that's going to do is it's going to grab the article id of the 
author page that we're looking at and then um, create a list of books that have the same author listed as the author that we're looking at. If that didn't make sense, it'll make sense soon. And we want them to show in a blog listing. And we just want to be able to see the cover of the book. And here we can also just change the typo. And we just want to display the image. We don't want to display as any of the thumbnails. And click Save and Close. Now if we go into the Module Manager, we create a new Seblod list module based on our list type called author books and we're going to call it my books and we're going to publish it in the position books this is what we set in the uh, module field earlier and click save and now when we go to an author page like myself my books appear and that's the one that we set up earlier so you can see now that there's a relationship between uh, the authors and the books that they publish. Let's just put another one in for fun. If we go into content, article manager, add a new book. Let's call this one the green book. And let's assign this to Sally. We can see before we do anything that Sally has no books and then when we save it and refresh her books appear. On the next episode we'll be looking at how to create custom templates and how our fields appear in the front end of our website. Tune in then and until then if you have any questions uh, please contact me on Twitter underscore JRMO or leave a comment in the comments below. Thanks.